Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm bringing you guys a Victoria's Secret haul. So I decided to go to the mall today. I don't really go to the mall because all of our stores are closing down. Like for real, we lose out from 21. We lost, um, I don't even know, to be honest. We lose so many stores. So when we're, I just run a shop online, I rather not walk in there. But when it comes to Victoria's Secret, I have to go in there because it's just one of those stores to hit or miss. You just never know. But today is my smell good edition because you know you guys smell good for your man. You guys smell good. Ain't nobody want no big girl that smell like old hamburgers and grease. You don't want that. So, so I needed some new scents and I need to go in there and get my mom a Mother's Day gift. So. <laughs> Her gift is actually not in the bag. I went ahead and gave it to her because I can't hold on to anything. So the first thing I got, I have never tried this one before, but I got the Exotic Bloom fragrance. I actually smelled this in the store, and this one actually just caught my eye. It was actually caught my nose. It just smelled really good, and I was trying to change up my scent a little bit. And this one's like more of a fruity kind of thing, and it kind of reminds me of some gum in a way like fruity gum and for some reason this one I know I can use this one every day and I will not get mad I won't get upset I know I can just keep using it all the time and then I also got the lotion some biscuit so I got the lotion to go with it because I cannot just go in there and not get some lotion to match it because it feels to have a scent and no lotion. I've done that before. I walked in somewhere, got a body spray, and thought, oh my god, why did I get the lotion to go with it? Now I gotta mix lotions. And it's gonna create with some concoction. So I did not get the body wash to go with it because I decided that I didn't need the body wash. I didn't really I knew I was short playing. Oh my god. I actually meant to get the body wash and I accidentally put it back. Now that I'm counting my head. Never mind, never mind. Scratch that, scratch that. So the next one I got from the store was this one called Sheer Love. I have never tried this one as well. This one is another fruity kind of smell but this one makes me feel like like all the sex in this one for some reason this one actually makes me feel naughty and it makes me feel like i don't want to wear it every day i just want to wear it when i want to feel naughty it's just oh my god it smells so delicious so yeah you guys need to check this one out. I'm going to put the link below. But that this one is actually becoming another favorite. My favorite one I used to use all the time was Love Spell. Love Spell was one of the ones that you will always find me having. And then I actually got one of Love Spell, but I got her the Love Spell Lace, I think it's called. Which, it kind of smells the same, but it kind of takes up a notch a little bit. So I understand Victoria's Secret, what they were trying to do. Because Love Spell is their highest selling fragrance body mist and lotion body wash to date right now so they're not going to try to discontinue that they just tried to enhance it which i understand why they did it but it kind of they changed the smell just a little bit just a little bit not enough to make you want to go oh to do to the formula but it was just like a subtle hint but i do recommend that so that's my mom's first body spray from Victoria's Secret right now is Let's Go. Like I said, it's one of my favorites. It's one of my husband's favorites. It's our go-to fragrance. I'm like, why not? Just smell it up. I mean, it's about the scent. So with this one, I actually got the lotion to go with it and I got the body wash because if I'm going to go sexy, I got to go sexy from the shower to the putting on the lotion to the mist. So I had to get all three. And then I got the, which one is this one? The Victoria's Secret Bombshell Roller. This one's in summer. This one actually is not staying with me. I actually went there and this is actually going into a baby shower gift. 
and I'm actually kind of wondering if I want to get rid of the superheroes, but I'm going to be bougie and keep it for myself. I might, I might drop them on my hard on coins on this. We're going to think about this, if it's going to go to a baby shower or not. And then I'm not really into um, a lot of different places with glosses because I have very, very sensitive lips. So I'm always reading the ingredients first of anything I put on my lips. And if you guys ever noticed in my previous videos, I'm always sticking to the same brands of lipsticks. It's very rare that I just have so many brands of lipsticks laying around. I will always go to the same go-to one just because if my lips can tolerate it, I'm just going to keep buying that brand. So I actually tried some of the Victoria's Secret brands because the one they were on sale, they were buy two, get one free. So, and in my mind, I'm like, they technically don't cost much more than an Anastasia Beverly Hill one. So we'll see. So I got the Extreme Plump being crystal clear I actually played with this in the store before I bought it home and it makes me tingle just a little bit and I didn't really want my lips it just it made it feel a little juicier but it didn't really even tingle I'm cutting it it didn't do all that I mean my lips are kind of big as it is right now so I really wasn't expecting much but I was just trying to see what they could do but like I said it made it feel a little juicy so that's the only reason why and there's my body, and I always wanted to try her lip plumper just to see what the big boo was, you know. So, the next thing I got was the Velvet Matte, and this one is a cream lip stain, and this shade is called Scandalous. It's a very, very, very cute lip stain, and you guys can see that it's very subtle, so it's not really over the top with it. Oh, I just went all crazy with that. Got all over the place. But yeah, it's very creamy and it's very soft and it really goes on really good with my skin color tone. So that's another reason why I got it and it was actually a very good fit for me. And then the last one I got from Victoria's Secret, this one is in Adored and this one is a soft pink matte. And of course, this is another velvet matte one, and this one as well. It is actually, it's a pretty pink, so can't deny it, can't deny it. So it's pretty pink, so I'm a little nervous about it. I'm going to have to play with it just a little bit, just because some nudes and some matte nude well some nudes I gotta play with I can't just say oh my god this is one that I'm gonna truly enjoy that much but we're gonna play and then I went next door to Bath and Body Works I knew this is a Victoria's Secret but I had to go next door because if anyone has to know if you have a Victoria's Secret credit card you also can use a Bath and Body Works so I'm just letting you guys know that now if you ever have one of those cards you can use it at both stores but you will not get the rewards for your card at that store so I you might as well just go pay in cash if that's just my advice but so I went and got the Japanese cherry blossom body scrub I actually have a lotion and body wash and this stuff goes so well and it's my skin goes so soft and just sweaty <laughs> so yeah this is the golden sugar scrub and I will tell anyone to get a sugar scrub for your body because oh my god it exfoliates and makes you feel so beautiful and wonderful and just gorgeous and just to die for <laughs> yes squirt it do it <laughs> and then from what the title says i'm going to be talking about my giveaway i'm not actually going to talk about it talk about it but i'm just letting you guys know when the date is so i'm just gonna let mother's day pass i'm gonna let it pass over and i'm actually going to post the giveaway on May 16th. Hopefully, I can post it on that day because I do have a conference for my job to go on that day. So I'm going to wake up super, super, super early and I'm going to post it because you guys deserve another giveaway. Like I said, this one is going to be in my favorite items. So I cannot wait to do this one for you. This one's going to be 
um, a mixture of two different items, face and body. So there's only two giveaways in one. So I know it's exciting. I know last time I did a surprise one in my giveaway, but this one is actually going to be two different types. So this one's going to be fun. I hope you guys enjoy it. So stay looking forward to that video. Like I said, on May 16th, that's when I'm going to put that video up. And I can't wait to explain it and show you guys all the fun little stuff that I have for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoy your Mother's Day if I don't get another video up by then. And another thing is I'm going to try to increase my video upload schedule. Even though I like doing it twice a week, I always felt like... I had just so much time going in between my videos. I just always was like, man, I should get another video up. I should get another video up. So I'm actually going to increase my time. I'll let you guys know either on my Twitter or on my Instagram what my new schedule will be. But I cannot wait to, to increase it for you guys. So without further ado, I'll let you guys go. Hope you guys enjoyed this little small haul with me. And I, like I said, I hope you guys have a great Mother's Day. Take care, my loves.